All right, so as you can see, I've removed the sample and I've switched to the 63X foil objective by pressing the proper button on the touch beam. When I did, it says change immersion. Please apply immersion or clean the objective specimen. This is actually uh, relevant to us because uh, we just switched this objective. We need to put oil on it. So to put oil on it, I'm going to use this oil. I'm gonna open it uh, one-handed. Hopefully I can do this. And if you look, uh, we don't really keep these oil bottles with a lot of oil in them. Um, so I'm going to dip the spatula, the plastic spatula, into the oil. You can see it there. We don't need a lot of oil, so I'm going to take it. And then the idea for applying it is to just gently touch to the front face of the objective. That's all we need. This is actually on the, uh, on the sort of high side of oil. You can even use less than that. So I'm going to close that, and then I'm going to put this sample again, the cover slip towards the objective. All right, there we go. And then I'm going to hit this done button here, and that will bring the objective up until it touches the sample or almost touches the sample. So in this case, it didn't do that. Uh, the oil is not touching the sample. So I'm going to raise it by moving the focus knob away from me until the oil does touch the sample. There we go. You can see the oil touch the sample, and you can tell because if I move the focus knob towards me, the oil slick gets smaller. That means the objective is going down. If I move it away from me, meaning I move the objective up, the oil slick gets bigger. So once you touch, you can see the oil slick. Just move a little bit down because you want to be below your sample uh, when you're trying to focus so that you know that if you go away from you, you're going to run into your sample. So I will focus uh, by eye and uh, we'll return to the confocal software once that's done.